Live from 10th Avenue in New York City, it's The Tin Show with Max Montgomery. And now, here's your host, Max Montgomery. All right, all right. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You may all be seated. Welcome to The Tin Show, everybody. I am so excited you're here tonight, and you sound great. You look great. So much better than last night's audience. Speaking of last night, a burglar broke into my house and stole all of my lamps. Yeah, I know. I should be more upset, but I'm actually delighted. (laughs) 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 Oh, good. Oh, that's funny. (laughs) Hey, Bafo, I heard that you went on a trip recently. Where'd you go? Well, I'll tell you where we went. We went to see the Liberty Bell. That's in Utah. Uh, Bafo, the Liberty Bell is in Philadelphia? I don't think so, Max. I think you're mistaken. I was there. I saw it. Okay, well, what did you think of it? (laughs) Well, Max, I'll tell you what. It wasn't what it... It wasn't, um... It wasn't what it was all... All corn nuggets. What was it? Are you trying to say it wasn't all it's cracked up to be? (laughs) No. Why do you ask? Never mind. (laughs) Ladies and gentlemen, please give a big welcome to Bafo and the Big Ten Band! (laughs) All right, all right. Whew! Well, it's time to get into our show, but, uh, hey! Bafo, you'll be interested in this. Who's there? No, no, I'm not doing a knock-knock joke. Hilarious! (laughs) Okay, whatever. Listen, we got an email from one of our fans. He told us he went to a resort for a vacation and they had a pet monkey there. It was running all around doing all kinds of stuff. Well, that got us thinking, what if we had a pet monkey? What would we have it do? So tonight's top 10 list is Top 10 Things We Wish Our Pet Monkey Could Do. Number 10, do my homework. Number nine, get a job to buy 60 pounds of candy. Number eight, juggle fire swords. Number seven, Go to school dressed as me. Number six, put that Ikea dresser together that's taking my dad forever. Number five, do motorcycle tricks. Number four, build a time machine. Number three, cook Thanksgiving dinner. Number two, guest star on Dude Perfect. And the number one wish we would want our pet monkey to do is write better top 10 lists. (laughs) Isn't that the truth? Well, it's time for us to welcome our guest. As you know, we've been celebrating 10 years on the air by bringing some of our past guests back onto the show. Well, tonight's guest, so much has happened in his life since he was last on the show. He's invented a new phone, He's released a new set of children's books. I mean, so much is going on. Would you give a hand for our friend, Robbie Banks? Thank you, Robbie. Wow, so glad that you're here. Listen, that's quite a list of accomplishments. How long has it taken you to do all this? About three days. Three days? Wow. Okay, well, let's see the new book. All right. Well, this is a brand new children's series called If You Give a Mouse a Pepsi. Uh, well, Robbie, that sounds a lot like the books If You Give a Mouse a Cookie. Oh, no, 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 no. You see, in my version, he gets a Pepsi. Uh, really? Well, uh, Robbie, I'm flipping through the pages, and uh, this actually is the book Give a Mouse a Cookie. All you did was put a piece of paper with a different title on it. (laughs) Okay, 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 forget that. Wait till you see my new cell phone. Okay, show it to us. It's a brand new revolutionary iRobbyU. The iRobbyU? I think you should call it the iRobby Apple. 
Robbie, that's an iPhone and all you did was put a label with your name on it. You're stealing other people's ideas. Ha <laughs> ha, whoops, uh, sounds like my wrap up music. Uh, I better get out of here. Thanks for having me on the show. <laughs> hey man, come back. Wow, Robbie really was stealing other people's ideas. The Bible clearly teaches in the Ten Commandments that stealing is never a good idea. As a matter of fact, the Eighth Commandment says do not steal. Well, you're going to learn all about that in your lesson today. You're going to learn how to respect other people's property and never, ever steal. That's all the time we have for the Ten Show. Until next time, we'll see you later, everybody! Ha <laughs> ha!